Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. It is that time again. It's February, Valentine's Day. What kind of better Valentine's present could you give yourself or someone else than a pet from Animal Services? And what better present for the animals to be out of here on Valentine's Day? Absolutely. It's better than chocolate. Well, and actually, so chocolate's really bad for them, so don't do that. But it would be a wonderful Valentine's gift all the way around. And they could be at your home giving you all the love that they have to give. You know Which it is a lot. Everybody needs that, and Tino has tons of it. He's quite small, and yet he has tons of love. It's one of those things that just works out great. Deborah, he's just a doll. How can you resist this guy? There's nothing not to love about him. He's a sweet little lap sitter. He likes other dogs, but mostly he just loves people. He's a good, he's a little bit of an older gentleman. We think he's about 10. That works in his favor, actually, because we does. have the senior rebate, which he qualifies for. It works for him, works for your wallet, works for everything. Tino is a great little dog. So we will about rebate $35 back on his adoption fee if you fall in love with this little guy and take him home. And if you just pick him up and hold him, you will fall in love with him because Ooh, yeah. he is a fabulous little guy. Tino's ID number is 203-616. This cute little baby was picked up in a Tascadero, um, and I cannot believe nobody has come looking for this dog. She is about as cute as a dog gets, just about two years old. If you're looking at the TV right now and you think, wow, that is a cute dog, I'd like to meet her, I would do it fast because she's not going to be here long. Uh, her name is Tempora. Her ID number is 203-867, and she needs to get out of here. Sure is cute. This is Chester. He is a gorgeous uh, German Shepherd, just about three years old, a neutered male. He's a fun guy, very nice. Um, he really loves women for some reason. Girls are his thing. But at any rate, uh, we are helping him with a little bit of training and a little bit of manners. But he is a nice dog that just needs some training. Chester's ID number is 203-409. We've gotten a lot of dogs in the last week or so. On the 4th, this little guy came in from North County in Shandon. A nice little dog, just, we think, only about seven months old. Kind of a long-legged little terrier guy or chihuahua mix or something who wants to go play. So if you want a playful little baby, come check this guy out. His ID number is 203-815. He has fabulous markings on his face. this poor little sweetie's owner passed away so she's with us she was with us before and she was adopted for a while she's very young she's just about a year and a half old very sweet little Deb, doggy she looks so sad she looks she just looks miserable uh, her name is Anna and I'm sure she misses her person terribly and can't figure out why she's back down here so we hope she's gonna get out of here really fast Anna's ID number is 201714 This is Sally. She's a shelter favorite. Um, we think she's just three or four years old. She's a little bit overweight, so I think she needs to get into a home where she has a little bit more active lifestyle. But we absolutely love this dog. And we and love her so much, Deborah. We made her the volunteer pick of the month. And you know what that means, Terry? That means you get about $50 off of her adoption fee, a little bit over that, which is great. You get half adoption fee paid for you, and you get this dog. Wow. She's a really sweet girl, very loving. Sally's ID number is 203-359. We don't just make any dog the volunteers pick. It's got to be one we really, really love. And we love her. This is Tinkerbell, another one of the shelter favorites. Just a dog that really, really loves her own people. She does well with some dogs, but probably her preference would, to be the, would to be the only dog in the home. Um, but just a loving, sweet lovely girl her half of her adoption fee has been paid because some volunteer loved her enough to pay that for her 
Her ID number is 153122. This is Tinkerbell. See how she admires herself in the TV Even screen. Even she thinks she's yes. beautiful. When you got it, you got it. Oh man, this one's a looker. Look over here, buddy. This is Orion. This is everybody's favorite. Well, one of their favorite dogs, including mine. He's great. He's a little bit, he's a little timid. The whole camera action thing's driving him a little bit crazy right now. Poor guy. But he's terrific. He loves especially female dogs. He and a dog we down, have down here named Marilyn just play their little bums off. Um, and he has those beautiful, beautiful blue eyes. Orion's ID number is 203-567. You should come meet him. He'll just melt into your lap and want to be your big old lap dog. Oh, this is oh, <laughs> a great little guy. He looks a little out of it because he just had, you know what, taken off. Um, and after your cherryectomy, you have, a, you have a tendency to look a little out of it. This is Banjo. Uh, just an adorable, wonderful, gentle, sweet little dog. Do not have one single bad thing to say about this great little guy. And he's as cute as he can possibly be. Isn't he be. cute? Look at those Aww. ears. He's on full receiver there yes. with those ears. Just a great dog. ID number 203-534. This is our little banjo. Terry, this dog is killing me down I here. I know it. She's been here since September, end of September. Just Can you imagine? No, I can't imagine she's it. She's so good. She's wonderful. Here's the deal, folks. You're going to come down here and look at Val, who is a great dog, and she's kind of going to ignore you. But that's just sort of her, her shelter, you know, aura or behavior. Uh, in a foster home, she's very attentive, very loving. Um, she loves to chase the ball. Most of all, she loves the water. This is a very good dog. She has half of her adoption fee, so that saves you half of, you know, 50-some dollars off of the adoption fee. 52 dollars 50 dollars mm -hmm. You can't beat that. You can go buy her lots of good stuff, toys and things like that. Val's ID number is 171165, and you got to come get her out of here because she's breaking our hearts down here. Think of all the fun you can have with an adopted pet. Contact your local shelter or pet adoption center. Back, Ammon? This is a little cutie pie. We think he's just five or six months old. Found um, at the airport, in pa or Meadow Larkin Airport in Paso Robles. And somebody should come claim this sweet little dog. He's scared down here, but he's just a sweetie. His ID number is 203-848. And if nobody comes to get him, we're going to call him Clancy. This girl is as beautiful as they come. We think she's about two years old. Um, she is just so pretty. She's kind of, again, kind of out of it. She just got spayed, so she's not totally with it right now. But she is actually a fairly high-energy girl, um, very good at jogging. We have some of our volunteers that jog with the dogs, and she's, she loves to jog. So a really nice, active dog is <laughs> about to lose her back in there because she's so out of it. Her ID number is 203-802. This is Shay. Ooh, you got some major cuteness factor coming in here. Look at that little guy. Just about nine months old. I can tell you this dog exhibits puppy behaviors. Uh, definitely a puppy. Going to need lots of chew toys, lots of training. But oh my goodness, oh the cuteness. His ID number is 203-850. And we're going to call this little guy Tully. Take two on the cuteness factor. This is the uh, little nine-month-old uh, mate. The other one was found with that you just saw. Uh, ID number 203-849. Again, we got puppy behaviors going on here, although this is probably the quieter, easier going of the two pups. Again, ID number 203-849. This baby we're going to call Marcus.
Got a little fire plug here. Came in on the 7th of um, February from Paso Robles, found at Sycamore Canyon. Paso, start putting some ID on our dogs, please. I'm from over there. I run into an awful lot of strays. We've got to start taking care, better care of our doggies. Uh, this little guy's ID number, 203914. We are going to call him Chunk. You can probably figure out why. That's a good head. That is a, that is a salami head if I've ever seen one. This sweet little girl's name is Boo Boo. She needs kind of a special home. She's a little bit on the fearful side. Um, she's really coming around since she's been with us. She's doing a lot better. Last week we couldn't get her up off her bed. This week she's doing much better. She just probably needs to go to a quiet, gentle, adults-only home. Would probably be the best thing for Boo Boo. Her ID number is 203-789. This is Boo Boo. Oh my gosh, beautiful dog. Look this at this is guy. This a big boy, Deborah. He, he is very big. He is very sweet. Apparently, he is a lap dog. That's always good to know when you got 100, do 100 pounds of dog. Um, what a doll. He was found, I think, in Santa Maria. And I can't believe no one's looking for him because he's just so nice. He's just about three years old. We absolutely love him here. Great ball dog. He knows sit. He, he fetches. Easy on the leash for such a big guy. What a great dog. His ID number is 203-869, and we're going to call him Atticus if nobody comes and finds him. Look at that beautiful dog. This dog is terrific. She came in relatively recently on the 6th of February. Uh, she was picked up in San Luis Obispo at Orchid and Johnson, and she has just been lovely. Um, just about a year old. She's been very good with other dogs. Um, she's just very sweet. Nothing bad to say about this darling girl. She's also easy to walk and all kinds of great things. Her ID number is 203-882. So here I am out with one of my good friends. This is where we go walking our dogs. We get to sit on some park benches now and again. It was a great opportunity for you guys to come out. We need volunteers. We'd really like some more dog walkers. We're at a point now where we just don't have enough people walking the dogs, and these dogs have to stay in their kennel day in and day out, 24 by 7. These dogs really need to get out, have a little exercise, feel the grass. You can sit with them out here, socialize them. It makes them ever so much more adoptable. So if you've got any time whatsoever, we could use you down here. Bring a friend. Two of you walk dogs together. We have dogs that get along with other dogs that you can go out with together. It's a fabulous opportunity for both you and the dog. We'd love to see you down here. It's easy to be a volunteer. We're a great bunch of people. I guarantee it. You can have a lot of fun and help the dogs. Think about it. Here's a pretty girl that was brought to the shelter on the 6th of February from Shandon. Um, so if somebody is missing their pretty blue pity, she's right here wishing you'd come get her. Um, seems like a very nice dog. She's uh, very playful. She's actually good on the leash. She seems to be house trained. Good girl. ID number 203-893. This is a newcomer to the shelter. You would recognize this dog by his eyes if he's yours. We found this dog on the 9th of February at Pismo Beach at the Edgewater Inn. Some vacationers maybe left him behind. I don't know. Pismo Beach. Uh, this dog is neutered. This dog is two years old wearing a blue canvas collar. Anybody lose this dog? His ID number is 203921. If this dog is not claimed, we're going to call him Emery and he'll be available for adoption. 203921. This beautiful dog uh, is named Hoover and his people could no longer keep him. He's just a year and a half old. Seems like a super nice dog. Um, we're really sorry he was turned in here, but we will be very happy to find him a new home. He's got those great Catahoula spots on him. He is a gorgeous dog. His ID number is 203-922. This is Hoover. Mm -hmm. 
this beautiful dog came into us as a stray on the 7th of, of February from the 300 block of Melshaw Road in Apomo. She's so pretty, beautiful female shepherd, just about three years old. She's, you know, just a really sweet dog. Um, probably not so good with cats, so we probably want to go to a cat-free home. Her ID number is 203915. I know we have a lot of, she of German Shepherd lovers out there in our county, so please come check her out. We're going to name her Mariah. Okay, we have got to get this dog out of here. She is longest residing. She has been here since August. She is a big, powerful girl that is as sweet as can be. You can do anything to her. You can, I mean, she never gets mad. Um, she does have a definite preference for male dogs, and her, the best thing that could happen to this dog is if you have a playful, big male dog at home that wants someone to play with them and just so they can just bounce around and beat each other up until they're both exhausted. Marilyn is the girl for that, and that's really what she needs, along with people who will give her lots of love because she's so affectionate. Half of her adoption fee has been paid. We love this dog so much. You, you'll see fireworks going off down here when Marilyn gets a home. Her ID number is 201307. This is Marilyn, half adoption fee paid. Love her, love her, love her. Please come meet her, please. <laughs> the owners could no longer keep this guy unfortunately just about two years old beautiful dog um id number 203923 come down and meet xander i think he's going to get adopted really fast We all love this dog so much. This is Hope. Um, she is a beautiful two-year-old female. She's been so good with other dogs. She's just a sweet, very gentle, nice, easygoing doggy. Um, she does have an injured back leg. It may require amputation, um, but it doesn't, it doesn't stop her. She's a great ball dog, terrific fetcher. That bad leg does not stop her one little bit, and she is beautiful, and she's a nice medium size. ID number... 203-698, shelter favorite, this is Hope. I think Pumpkin's shaking a little bit there and it's because she just got shaved. She came into us a matted up mess and now she's had a grooming and she looks beautiful. Pumpkin uh, was a, a stray that came in from Paso and um, she's a great little dog. ID number 203-800. Everybody needs to have a little poodle in their life. Well, now that we've got finished with all of those dogs, we have some very nice cats to show you. We're starting off with Misty. As you can see, Misty is a little tabby. She is very petite. She's just about six months old, and her ID number is 203650. She is very patient. She is very kind. She'd make a great lap cat. Just loves to be with people. ID number 203650. That is Misty. Next up, we have big, handsome Charles. If Charles stands up, you see his tail, you're going to die. If you love the Maine Coon type cats like I do, you're going to love Charles. He is big, he is handsome, he can be your best friend. He's just about four years old, and his ID number is 203784. Handsome Charles. And here's another little tabby. She looks so cool, calm, and collected. Lana looks like a queen there on her shelf. She is just about six months old and a doll. She is ID number 203651, Lana. 
This is the best thing you can possibly do for your companion animal. Put a collar and a tag on your friend, your dog, your cat. If they get lost, they'll get brought home to you rather than being brought to a shelter or a pound where overpopulation means that somebody gets euthanized. So please protect everybody. And folks, even if you have a collar or tag and identification on your pet, ask your neighbor if they do. If you see that a neighbor doesn't, please encourage them to identify their animal. It will save everybody's life and keep everybody alive. Here's Edie. She is uh, our volunteer pick of the month. We picked Edie because all of the volunteers decided that if they could take a cat home, it would be Edie. She is so gentle and so sweet. Edie's been here quite some time since before Christmas, if you can imagine that, and she's so, oh so patient waiting for her special person to come and adopt her. Is that you? We really, really, really would like Edie to get out of here very quickly. She's been here way too long. So, Find it in your heart to come down here and at least meet Edie and see if you want to take her home. ID number 203-115. She is the volunteer pick of the month. What does that mean? If you adopt Edie, you get half her adoption fee already paid. So she is half adoption fee paid. Edie, ID number 103-115. No! Banzai Cat is attacking the village! Mighty Banzai Cat is stalking before the final kill. We'll never get out of here alive if he sees us! We'll never escape in time. Ah! Medic! Medic! Is this the end of civilization? Mighty Banzai Cat waits no more! Ah! With one flick of the tail, it's all over! Colonel, where's that airstrike or that? Mm, the bombers are useless against Banzai Cat! Think of all the fun you can have with an adopted pet. Contact your local shelter or pet adoption center. Yes, there is a cat in all of that lump of fur. This is Marshmallow. Marshmallow is a male. Marshmallow is about six years old, long-haired, as you can see, uh, flame point Persian. ID number 203777. He is one of a kind, that Marshmallow. ID number 203777. Next up, we've got Leona. You people out there who are crazy for gray cats, you know who you are. Leona is perfect for you. She has those beautiful green eyes, blue-gray color for her fur. She is gorgeous. She's just about five months old, and her ID number is 203910. That's Leona. You fans of orange tabbies, here is an orange tabby. This cat is a newcomer to the shelter. We have found this cat on the 6th of February in the North County in Paso Robles on the 300 block of Amund. This cat is male, about a year old. ID number 203892. Say hi to Diego. Diego is one of those big, handsome orange tabbies. Diego is about two years old. ID number 192229. Diego. Well, here's a newcomer to the shelter. This cat's got a very distinctive face and face markings. Are you missing him? This cat's about a year old. We found him on the 6th of February in the South County in Napomo on the 100 block of Oak Glen. The ID number on this cat, 203896. Here's a big, beautiful black and white. We found this cat on the 7th of February 
in the South County on the 100 block of Oak Glen in Napomo. This cat is male, about two years old. Are you missing him? ID number 203913. Next up, we have Wilson. Wilson is a Scottish fold. We rarely, rarely get Scottish folds here, but Wilson just so happens to be one. So if you're a fan of Scottish folds, Wilson's the boy for you. As you can see, he's a black and white. He's just about four years old. His ID number, 203905. That's Wilson. Next up, we've got Lefty. He is a big tabby. Lefty is about five years old, and his ID number is 203806. Lefty. Here's a cute little tabby. We are naming this cat Dolly. Dolly is about one year old. She is ID number 203817. Dolly. Yes, you're right. This is not a cat. No, no, no. This is a bunny. This is Malibu. Malibu is male, just about a year old. He is ID number 202508. And if you fancy a bunny rabbit, come on down and meet Malibu and take him home with you. ID number 202508. 